welcome to the 24 drunken days of December. We are now on the second to last day. It is day 23 and it looks like we're going to be having an interesting one. So what do we have today? Today we actually have something that I have never seen before and I'm actually quite intrigued. It is a barrel aged IPA coming at 6.5% alcohol by volume. Barrel aged IPA. I don't know. That, uh, it does sound interesting. Hopefully it's just as good. Now as you see we uh, managed to get a ton of snow overnight. Um, day 21 I was filming outside. Day 22 filming inside. Day 23 filming outside. Alright, see so we got. I got my snow covered glass so it's... Is that the same as a chilled glass? Don't know. Okay, put that back in the snow. And by the looks of things, it's clear. Two fingers worth of head and very light carbonation on there. There you go. I don't know, it doesn't look too bad. The smell from what I'm getting from here is actually not that bad either. I'm getting sort of a floral hop note. All right, let's have a proper smell. Well, my nose might be freezing up because it's still a little cold out here. But I get a sort of a tropical sense on there. A little bit of earthy note. And a little bit, just a little bit extra. Kind of sort of like a, a juicy note. All right, let's see what this barrel aged beer has. Cheers. Huh. Well, that's wild. Wow, okay. So, you have the wooden notes of a barrel. You have um, sort of like a, are these bur bourbon barrels? Or what are they made out of? Yeah, bourbon oak barrels. So I do have that wooden note and uh, that bourbon note on the on the forefront, which gives it a little bit of a sweetness. And then the uh, earthy um, hops on the end pretty much outdo everything else. That is wild. Okay, um, I don't mind that, I really don't. It's not that bad at all. It's different, it's actually really different. I, I really don't mind that at all. It's uh, got some good flavors to it. I wouldn't think of barrel aging an IPA though. That's, that's different. That's something that you shouldn't be doing anyways because the IPA is, the notes on there might fade away, but this one, the bitterness stays on the end at the very back of the throat. Hmm, and this comes at what, 6.5%? Yeah. So, score, because I'm freezing, I need to go inside, is, well, they redeemed themselves on the last day. This is a nice 8.5 out of 10. Not something I think would work, but it does to its degree. It does have the wooden notes, it does have the bourbon, and it does have the bitterness of the IPA at the end. That's actually pretty decent. All right, Red Racer, you redeemed yourself. Good work. Okay, I'll be back for day 24 and any bonus videos I do in the meantime. Till then, I'm PK saying cheers, stay frosty, and we'll see you real soon. Thanks again and have a good snowy day. Cheers.